The makeup I'm doing today is one that I want to do very differently from what I've done before. And this is really because of the clothes color I'm wearing. So I'm gonna start off with my BFF, um, because I need to do that. But I'm gonna just show you a different skin, hair and eye combination. See, look, BFF. I've woken up, finally. I'm using Trintron, because I have got dark circles. And again, I use Trintron as my just a touch in the shade I am. So if you wear fake tan, ladies, I'll give you an example of things. If you have what I call peaches and cream skin, but you wear fake tan, you'd go into peaches and cream and you think, mm, that's the color of my skin if you're being honest, first thing in the morning in front of the mirror. But if you're somebody who wears fake tan and you sleep in fake tan and you're always in fake tan, then you've got to go to light tan because that's a peaches and cream skin who wears fake tan. So when you do match to me, it's incredibly specific about how you treat your skin, whether it burns, watch those videos. But I do believe to choose your foundation shade in the color of your skin and use other products to make it um, more colorful. So use Gold Glow if you want to give yourself some color. But don't try and do it with your foundation because you want your foundation to blend in. You don't want weird lines there. You want everything to feel blended. It's so important. It's gonna make you think, I've never had skin that looks this good. And that's, that's what we all want, don't we? We want people to look and say, my God, your skin looks great. And that's what I want to do. So I've put on my just a touch that, all done, like that. And now I'm going to do a little bit of golden glow for you because I think it'd be nice for you to see if you want a little bit of a tan. So I'm going to use Genster, which is my sort of winter tan moment. I very rarely put tan on, you know that, but this is the difference between applying a fake tan, which can clog your pores or, you know, there's good ones out there, but I still think people's skin is not fantastic with it. I'm putting on a gel just to give you some extra color that day. So I put it on in the middle and then I just go up to where the sun would hit my forehead okay like that and then I don't go right up to here because generally with the sun you don't but you can just see I'm getting a gentle color and then I can just take this and just go gently around again where the sun would hit which would be on the thinnest part of my skin my cheekbone there maybe a bit the end of my nose a bit on my chin so now I've got a bit of color. I could have come back from South France two weeks ago, um, but it's that easy and that I used Genster. All right, but there is also a darker shade called Swala, which is if I had come back from Ibiza two days ago. There. Now, next up, something that some of you do find tricky is contour. And contour is such a fad and I kind of, you know, was always scared of contour, but we created two shades and I'm gonna use Kate. And you take this much, okay, it's literally, I've dabbed my finger in it. And then I warm it up in my fingers like that. And then I go and I start up my hairline so I don't make a mistake. And I just bring it down here like that. And I create more of a shadow. And I never go further than my brow line to here, all right, like that. There, I'll do the other side and bring it down give myself a little bit of definition, and then just blend it up like that, blend it up, okay? So you just see a little definition, little rays of sharpness. Then I'm gonna take some Starlight, and Starlight, I've got them both in here actually, Starlight is our um, highlighter. I'm gonna take you a full one out actually, so I can show you. Hang on, let me undo this. Oh, goodness gracious, one second. Let me undo it properly. <laughs> Okay, then I'm going to do Starlight. Here's Starlight there. Starlight is our highlighter. We are bringing out another highlighter soon, ladies. Beautiful highlighter. But this is like the cleanest, easiest highlighter. So I'm just going to go above my brow bone like that. Uh, not my brow bone, sorry, my, my um, cheekbone. And I'm just dabbing it there like that. So it just catches the light. Catches the light, you see. And then I'm going to do here, like that, catches the light, like that. And then I might even just for now do a little bit above here. I could... Now eyes, I'm wearing this greeny colour, so what I'm going to do is actually, I'm thinking, do I do... Mm, I have an idea. I have an idea of what I'm going to do, and I want to show you. 
and it involves this is something I've been doing so mad it's so mad but I'm gonna do it because I want to do it okay I'm really mad so I'm going to take a lip to cheek in munchkin and I'm gonna take a tinker lip love because I think these colors I like together so with the munchkin which is a lip to cheek it's like a plum color I'm gonna start because I'm gonna build up my face all at the same time so I'm just gonna do a tiny stain here just get a bit more pigment to my lip it's, it's really tiny tiny bit on my cheek like that like a blusher and then take a little bit more and I'm going to just do a little bit here of that wash. It's a wash, ladies, nothing more than a wash of the aubergine like that. Do the other side, a little bit of a wash, the lightest wash. This will hopefully really make my blue eyes pop like that okay and then and then i'm gonna get katinka which is a lip love which looks like that when i got it on so i'm just gonna just do a little of that like that on my eye i'm gonna do that like that so i Kind of put it on, I lift up my eyelid, I put it on like that. And then I take my clean finger and I just blend it here like that. Blend it. And then here, just a bit more. And I take my clean finger and I blend it like that. And then I'm going to get sun. Complicated, but it's fun. We just want to have some days when we really play with makeup and just do in the middle here. This is also probably even a much better look for brown eyes because the amount of ladies who asked me about brown eyes and I did this with a lot of women with kind of olive skin, brown eyes and, and dark hair and it made their brown eyes so bright. It's much harder to get brown eyes to look bright, but I'm bright now, I'm really there, I'm present. My God, I'm present. I'm gonna take some brow now and just do my brow there. I'm using, um, what am I using today? Benetint, no, Benefit, little mini one I got at Christmas. There. And then I'm gonna do the mascara, I'll tell you more about it later. I might do a little bit on my lower lashes. Then you think to yourself, all right, I've got quite a strong look here. What's my, have I got enough on my lip? Should I bring my lip down? So I'm gonna go back to that munchkin because I like the tonality of it. Put it on. Quite a strong look this now. But then, Maddie, lip glow. Maddie's really clever at toning down lip. So it nudifies it but still keeps the tone there. And then I take the last little bit that's still on my cheek and I just put that over the munchkin because it kind of brings out that lovely sort of shimmer like that. And then I'm gonna finish off. So I'm gonna take a little bit of face finish, which is our mattifier. And I'm just going to put it around my nose area like that, there, because I don't want to be shiny there. Put it around here under my eye, around my nose, and like that. And then a little bit here where I get slight shininess. So that's my quite a lot of makeup look. And I just think that my eyes look really bright. I have got more makeup than I normally put on, but this is filter free ladies. And this is just showing you how you can get great skin, do a slightly tanned look with quite a strong eye and a lip and everything goes together because my kind of continual product I've used is munchkin on my eye and my cheek and my lip 
and then I've gone and, and used the joy of Katinka and just put that on and I could even just take a little bit of Katinka and just put it on again on here, you know, just play, I can keep playing. Um, so, voila, there you have it, my sort of fun, bright, a bit more makeup than normal look.